Do t-shirts sell better in the summer? Let's talk about it. What's up everybody and welcome back to the channel. If you're brand new here and we don't know each other, what's up? My name's Carrie. I'm the founder of Shirt School and I created this channel to bring you the best strategies, secrets, and hacks to grow your online t-shirt, apparel, or print-on-demand business. In today's video, we're going to talk about do t-shirts sell better in the summer, right? Is this a time to go all in with your t-shirt business or just selling t-shirts if you're selling any kind of apparel on your website? So I kind of want to break that down today. So the short answer is yes, t-shirts sell more in the summer. This is kind of obvious, obviously, right? It's warmer in more areas of the, of the United States, or if it's summer in another country, like it's just warmer in more areas. So people are reaching for the t-shirt, the tank top, the v-neck or whatever, short sleeves, because it's hotter. Now, does the data actually back this up? And I would say 100%. If you do a quick Google search and you just put in, do t-shirts sell better in the summer, you're gonna find a plethora of articles just showing that t-shirt sales can be somewhat seasonal. And so even though t-shirts will sell year round, in my opinion, you're going to start to see a spike in the spring and you're really gonna see t-shirt sales start to max out in the summer right? I think the other exception is around Christmas. People will buy t-shirts just because they're an inexpensive, cool, fun gift. So you can also sell a ton of t-shirts around uh, Christmas, obviously, but spring and summer, and especially summer are the best times to sell t-shirts and more people will be buying them because they're looking for that lighter, uh, cooler uh, apparel to wear. So if summer is the best time to sell t-shirts, what does that mean for you as a seller? Well, it means you should... Do you want to learn our shirt school system on building a profitable and sustainable online apparel business? If so, I want to invite you to go watch a completely free class over at shirtschool.com. I'll teach you the three pillars of the shirt school system. I'll show you how to get set up, how to get set up and running. And at the end, I'll give you an opportunity to learn about our shirt school program, which has helped thousands of people from around the world create five, six, and even seven figure online apparel businesses. I'd love for you to consider being a part of our community and our program. So if you want to go check that out completely free, no obligations, shirtschool.com is the place to do it. It means you should really consider going all in right now while summer weather is here. If you've seen that your sales have been down a little bit over the winter and into the new year, well, now's the time to really double down on your content, on promoting your products and potentially running advertising like Facebook and Instagram ads or maybe TikTok ads. Now's the time to put a little more effort and go all in because you'll likely see that your sales really start to spike and really start to kind of run wild at this time. And you've got a really good runway here of three or four months where you can really maximize your sales. And with unlimited potential selling potential, Central on the internet, you should really consider putting in more resources and really going all in right now. The other time of the year, as I mentioned, to really do this is around Christmas, right? Everyone has their wallets open, they're spending money around Christmas. And so you really want to also go all in at that time and really push your marketing, push your sales more than you normally would. So I just want to throw that encouragement out to you today that if you're really, number one, looking to break in to t-shirts and apparel, maybe start up a business, now's the time. Let's go. If you have a business and maybe sales have been down for you or you haven't really been sure you know, when to go all in or what to do, now's the time. Now is the time to put your resources in and really start selling and marketing uh, as much as you can. Another thing I quickly want to talk about is just realizing that the different seasons really support different types of products, right? If you're selling t-shirts in your store, maybe when it starts to get cold, obviously you can start selling sweatshirts and hoodies, right? And if there's a time of the year where you're not seeing that apparel is selling, consider selling something else, maybe like mugs or stickers or something that might support that time of the year, right? The other thing in summer that you can think about is like people are outside, people are doing things outside, people are, you know, drinking more beverages, all those kind of things. So mugs, tumblers might be a great product to sell during the summer. In the winter, you might sell blankets and you might sell hoodies and those kind of things. So think about your business in that way, right? Think about what is going on in the world. 
and what type, what time of the year it is. And don't, you know, you don't always have to just sell t-shirts year round, right? You can incorporate other products at certain types of years or put more marketing behind other products at certain types, times of the years. In working with thousands of students here at Shirt School, we number one see that sales do spike when it's warmer outside, spring and summertime. We see the most sales. We see this is when people are getting tons of, of results on their store more than other times of the year. And we what I also see, which is interesting, and why I bring up that last point, is that I do see that people are really pushing t-shirts no matter what time of the year it is. And I think there is a strategic kind of a strategy there that you know you might want to think about right what is happening right now what's the weather like right now what are, are people outside inside and what products really support that depending on the time of the year so something interesting to think about i hope you enjoyed this video today and i hope this was helpful to you see you in the next one